Hi guys. So I'm coming to you. I have zero makeup on. Um, part of that is um, because I'm really exhausted and the other part is that I might cry during this video. So here we go. Um, the title, I'm just going to make it full disclosure because that's what today has to be. Um, a couple of weeks ago during Mercury Retrograde, and this was, this was a very hard decision for me to make to make this video um, because and not because of the, the majority, like 99% of you are going to watch this and understand where I'm coming from. It's that 1% that has to insert themselves into situations that are like, ah. Um, but that's what, that's what this is, you know, that's what YouTube is all about. So anyways, um, being a Virgo, I fought um, with how to present this information. I've been thinking about it for weeks, and today's just the day. Like, I have to do it today. Um, a couple weeks ago, well, the first week of Mercury Retrograde was really, really tough. You guys sort of watched me go through some things in the last couple of weeks. And it's not that my life is bad. Like, I kept on reiterating that. Everything is going really, really well. But I found out that I'm sick. And it's not like a cold, right? <clears throat> it's not life-threatening. Um, it's treatable. It is, um, we can manage it. Uh, I'm not going to disclose what it is right now because there are still sort of some things that are up in the air because I don't have all the information. That's why it's hard to do this video. Um, but I think I need everybody to know that um, that's why things are, have been a little bit erratic lately. Um, the, it's like the ironic part of it is that my life is better now than it has been. Like I could probably say that my life is better now than it ever has been in my entire, in my entire existence. Um, but unfortunately my body is failing me at the moment. And so I have an amazing team of doctors. I have an amazing support system. I have, um, an amazing job. <clears throat> so the reason why I'm bringing this up today is because I'm not, I'm still going to be on the channel. I'm still going to be doing general readings. Um, I've been for quite some time saying I'm cutting off personal readings after this time. I'm cutting off, I'm going to, I'm going to fill up March and then I'm going to cut off personal readings, right? I've been saying that for a good month and it's basically since when I first figured out, um, actually it was like a week before I figured out, I could tell there was something wrong and that I needed to take some time off. Optimistically, I thought that I would be able to get through March with personal readings, and unfortunately, um, that's just not the case. So I'm having to reassess my energy. I'm having to reassess things. Um, I'm not going anywhere. I still want to do the daily readings, and, and this is why I have to um, reassess my energy, because I want to still be present. Like, I love what I do. I love showing up for you guys every day. Because showing up for you guys, I'm showing up for myself, too. Um, this will keep me active. This will keep me going. This will keep, this is, this is what um, keeps me alive, you know, right, right now. This is, like, one of the biggest things that's keeping me moving forward and positive and optimistic. However, um, personal readings really take a toll. And if you are a reader yourself, you understand how I can say it's, it's a lot easier sometimes to read for the collective than it is for one for one particular person with a personal reading. So in saying that, um, we've already, Jessalyn and I have already contacted um, some people, the people for this week. Um, there was something that happened this week. I ended up with an infection. And with an infection, um, it makes everything else worse. <laughs> Like, my immune system is compromised right now, basically. So any kind of infection, this isn't the coronavirus, by the way. For that one person that's going to ask me if I'm sick with the coronavirus, I'm so not. I'm so not. Um, but um, because I do have an infection, I'm extra tired. And that's the biggest thing is, is that, that it's taking a toll on me when it comes to being exhausted and being tired. So I'm having to reassess the personal readings. Um, if you have a personal reading with me scheduled during March, you will receive an email from Jessalyn or from myself, probably from Jessalyn first. Um, 
she's um, really she's been really helping me a lot to get through all of this. And we we really thought that the way that we were um, scheduling the personal readings in March that it wasn't going to be so heavy for me. But it already I, I can already tell that I don't want to. Um, I can't disappoint you guys. Like I can't disappoint my clients. That's my biggest thing. I think that's been my biggest worry through all of this is that I'm going to be disappointing you guys. And I know that that's silly. And, um, you know, even my, my, the best of friends keep telling me that I'm silly for thinking about other people at a time like this, but that's just who I am. So I can't really help it. Um, but if you do have a personal reading with me, you're getting the option, um, to either postpone. I don't know <laughs> how long it's going to be postponed. I, we will have more answers, um, later this week. We'll have, you know, I mean, like it, everything unfolds is unfolding, like, in the way that it's supposed to right now. And um, because I don't have any answers, I'm giving everybody the option to either postpone or to um, um, refund. And I I don't usually give the option to refund, so you can tell that that's like, like I want to make sure that you guys know that I am not trying to take advantage of you in any way, shape, or form with any of this. So if you have a personal reading with me, you will be contacted. Um, if you have a personal reading with me and you haven't been contacted yet, or you think that, um, you haven't been contacted yet, um, you'll be contacted at least, like, it'll be like the week before your reading. So, um, we're slowly getting those emails out. Just give us some time. Um, but yeah, I will still be here. I am still planning on, um doing the weekly meditations, that actually has helped me a lot as well. So I'm doing that through the memberships um, on Patreon or, um, excuse me, on the channel here. Um, I'm also going to still be doing the love readings with you because I know that the people that are the members on Patreon, like I want you guys to know that I'm still going to be around. I'm not going anywhere. And um, I feel like I have days where I feel really, really, really good. And that's why this is hard because I don't look sick. I mean, sometimes I look a little bit more tired than I should yesterday. Man, yesterday took a turn for the worse after that morning reading. But um, I will be a lot more transparent with you guys as because you guys know that I teach and I lead through my life. And I know that the life experiences that I go through it's because I'm supposed to be going through this so I can look at somebody and say, you're not alone. I know how that feels. I know what you're going through. So, and I don't want anybody to feel bad for me. Like, that's a big thing. I cannot, please do not feel bad for me. Don't feel sorry for me. Um, I will be as honest with you guys as I possibly can. Um, I won't give you information um, that I don't know yet. Like, if I'm a little bit elusive about stuff and please feel free to contact me if you're worried about me, if you, you know, um, don't think that I'm not going to be available, okay? Just because I have to move some personal readings around. Um, it's just so I can take care of my energy, to make sure that I take care of my energy. And um, I'll be back to 100% eventually. Uh, it's it's going to be a journey. It's going to take a little bit of time for me to get there. But, um, you know, I want, I, you know, you guys are kind of part of my journey, to be quite honest. Like, you guys are a part of this. I think this video is probably the hardest thing for me to do because I'm like, how do I talk about this without giving too much information but not being, you know, too elusive at the same time and letting you guys know that um, every, that I am fine. Like, I'm, I'm okay. I am fine. And, um, man, I'm just blessed. I'm just really blessed. So, I love you guys. And I'm not going to do a reading this morning. But I do love you guys. And uh, I'll be back. Bye.